Okay, so I tried Holy Vessel of Examiner. So let's try the vessel of Examiner. You know, it could also be the vessel contains Examiner. I mean, there's there's a lot of combinations here. The, this puzzle is far too vague. The vessel contains Zamna. The vessel Holy Vessel of No 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 sorry no I I did. Man, having to reactivate this chip every single time is freaking annoying. Okay, I've done Holy Vessel. I've done the vessel. Well, it's like, I guess it's not vessel, it's, it's breath. Um. The breath of examiner. There we go. Hey, that's an environ cartridge, isn't it? And it's loose. It hasn't been incorporated into the artifact like in the other time zones. You should take it. Maybe it'll provide us with some information. Oh, sorry. Uh, <laughs> This one's on the house. Well, there's nothing else to do here. Let's go ahead and get the heck out of here. I don't want to be Gino. If Gino's behind all this, I'll be very disappointed in him. I should probably save. 74. The final clue. Yeah. It's a touch optimistic, perhaps. Where is it? There it is. Buckle up, guys. Sinclair, is it you? Okay. This cartridge is the final piece you'll need to build a time machine. You should also have the Da Vinci Codex, which contains various formulae. The sculpture, which morphs into a schematic diagram and the medieval sword which holds the energy focusing element. This cartridge contains all existing notes, plans, and diagrams on the construction of the neutrino matrix accelerator, the time machine's power source. You'll be able to recreate the accelerator from these notes. By using the formulae schematics and focusing element to control the accelerator and harness its power, you'll be able to turn it into a functioning time machine. The information on this cartridge has been arranged in chronological order, starting with the building of the accelerator's framework, and following the process of its construction through to the final phase. Good luck. And may Sorry to interrupt, Gage, but I need that back. Oh. You freaking cow. But why? Oh good, you're awake. Don't bother trying to move, your suit's disabled. 
I've got you hooked up to the jumpsuit maintenance frame. Well. It took me a while, but I finally figured out how you did it. I remembered that Agent 8 told me that when you broke house arrest, he found you back in your old apartment without your suit. So that was the gauge that I know. And he jumped back into the past to enlist your help, right? Because he knew that he was being watched. You certainly are resourceful, aren't you? I didn't even know that that was possible. Just when I thought I had you under my control, you go and pull something like this on me. But why? While you were unconscious, I looked at your evidence biochip. That's some pretty incriminating stuff. Looks like I've got no choice. I'm going to have to erase it and uh, mind wipe you. <laughs> well, at least you won't remember how painful it was. In fact, when you wake up back in your apartment in the year 2319, you won't remember that any of this ever happened. Or, uh, will happen, I guess. Well, first, I, I've got to send back the uh, environ cart that you stole from me. Despite your best efforts, humans are no longer the only beings capable of time travel. It's for the better, Gage, believe me. We can't... we just can't be trusted with, with such a powerful tool. Human nature would eventually drive us to use it for the wrong reasons. And if we're not the only ones with the technology, maybe we won't be as tempted to misuse it. My contact promised me that it would be given to every race of the symbiotry that wants it. Right, sure. That explains why. Uh oh, Gage, this doesn't look good. The jump controls are locked out and she's got you completely immobilized. While you were taking a commercial break, she hooked us up to this thing. She's been downloading stuff from your biochips ever since. She hasn't discovered me yet, but I'm afraid it's just a matter of time. I keep trying to sneak a peek down the data stream, but I'm afraid I'm gonna stand out like a... like a... Rat in a garden house. Hey, that was pretty good. Anyway, I'll keep trying. Sure. You probably think that I'm ill, that uh, I'm insane. Uh, I really can't blame you. I mean, no one from our generation has ever seen how aggressive we can really be. Or the generation before us, for that matter. Or <laughs> the ones before that. But every single one of my historical research missions involved studying war. I've been to the Nazi death camps in Hiroshima. I've seen the terrorist massacres. I've lived it. I know. You can't possibly imagine the horror of seeing a bustling city of thousands vaporized by, by a nuclear firestorm, or a crowd of people shredded into bloody ribbons by a single shrapnel. As you watch, helpless. But that's what happens when we feel the need to bear our teeth. It's human nature. And it's not something that, that just a couple of hundred years can, can erase. Look around you. Do you know what this place is? It's a, it's a missile silo. Well, a few centuries ago, there were tens of thousands of these, and each one contained a nuclear missile powerful enough to obliterate an entire sector. That's enough to destroy the world 50 times over. Yet just three centuries later, even before the physical reminders are gone, we're claiming that we've matured into a peaceful race of beings. How can we be that naive? That's it! She just took up the pipeline I needed. I'm gonna swim up and see if I can stop her. Okay. You probably figured out that I was the one that rigged the security group. I had to be able to get the things I needed from the Pegasus warehouse without being seen. But when you started asking around about the mistake in the grid, well, I mean the future you, that is, um, I had to change my plans. So, 
Instead of just sending the information to my contact, I came up with the idea of hiding it in historical artifacts, artifacts from your research dates that were also slated for sale at the Louvre Art Auction. That way, all I had to do was tell my contact which items to buy, and the transaction was nearly impossible to trace. And if anyone started digging around because of what they saw, well, <laughs> they'd discover the ripples and come straight back to you. I even found some valuable trinkets to plant in your locker if that happened. Just that one simple move would give you a motive and the court a scapegoat. But, um... I didn't want to have to do it. I never thought for a second that someone might accidentally discover the ripples. I mean, how often do we do manual scans? Someone must have been bored out of their minds that day. I'm sorry, Gage. I really am. If I could be the one that was arrested, if, if I could take responsibility for my actions, I would in a second, believe me. I had no choice. I, I don't want to do this to you, but if I don't, it will all have been for nothing. If they find out how the technology was spread, they'll be able to, to keep it from ever happening. That's, that's the problem with time travel. Nothing's ever safe. That's why I had to do it. I had to even the playing field, even a little. I'm sorry if, if I'm making you an unwilling martyr to my cause, but that's just the way it's gotta be. Please understand. Why am I even bothering with this? You're not gonna remember any of this anyway. It makes you feel better. Is is that all okay? The I'm there. It's all hooked up. Everything. It's all controlled to the neural link into our suit. We can create a virus and shut the whole thing down. Just need to get into. No. There's a password gauge. I need a password. What do you know about Michelle? I'm setting up an interface. I need a password. But we've got instant Alzheimer's. Let's see what you can dig up. Hurry! Is it expecting me to... Okay, yes, it's expecting me to type. Uh... Do I have access to my inventory? Gage, we're running out of options here. I need that password now. Uh... God knows. I mean, I... I barely know her. Um. Oh shit, she's gone. I... Uh... Personal? I don't have anything written down about her, I don't think. Time zone, blah blah blah, changed. She's uh. past the last safety lockout gauge. Don't get me in there now, our minds might not be the only things erased. This well, I... be in for a serious rewrite. We're the only ones, Gage. Gotta do it. Nope, sorry. That's it. Get ready to have your memory erased. This is gonna hurt you more than it hurts me. Having interrupted Agent 3's scheme by taking the most in integral piece of the time machine plans, Agent 5 unintentionally drew her directly to him. He was captured by Agent 3, who then completed her mission and erased his memory to prevent further interference. Um. I'm looking through my notes. But, I mean, I... <laughs> I'm not quite sure how you can be expected to 
even have such things in your mind. I mean, it it has been weeks since I last looked at any of this. Uh, um, the, 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 those intro documents, the only thing that sticks out in my mind is freaking Gino. Um... I'm nope. I've got nothing in in my notes uh, about this. But hey, that's why we have uh, save games. Let us go and take a look at. Uh... I'm not sure if there was anything in the pieces of paper. What about? D d didn't she leave us a? Did she leave us a message? You have. Oh, no, not him. No, no. You have. What? Stop it! What did you? say ground fall? It sounded like ground fall. Uh, good. Let, me, let, me, let me find a, a page upon which to write some stuff. Uh, th this will do. Ground fall. Tahiti. Oh yeah, that was just the guy telling us about the suit. Blah de blah de blah. Oops. Blah de blah de blah. Doop de doop de do. Nothing there. Nothing there. Something in evidence? The boot number, maybe? Is that a four or a nine? I guess that'll be a it'll be a nine, won't it? Three, three, five, three. Then there's either another three, or it's a nine, two, two, seven. I. That kind of makes sense, I guess. I'm going to have to sit through that dialogue again, aren't I? So I didn't actually get a chance to save my game. 3353, three, then either 39227 or just 9227, with or without a hyphen. 
The only other place I can think where there might be information is in the the news report. But I can't immediately... I can't immediately recall her being in the news report. Save it, yeah. 75. Final pre. Find that biochip, uh, environ cartridge rather. Yeah, there, there were a lot of things I wanted to say uh, during this whole thing, but naturally I wanted to let her speak the first time through. So she's obviously doing this because she is in the camp that believes that time travel is just too dangerous to let any one person have. However, I would wager that she's probably being used. I would wager that she is likely going to give these plans away and then be betrayed. I don't know... Obviously, because she covered all of this, I keep saying obviously, because she covered all of this war stuff and the killing, it's somewhat broken her inside and she hasn't received the necessary counselling to uh, deal with it. So, I would wonder... I mean, she, she, she sort of seems partially like a victim here. But at the same time, you can't just go around messing with time causing this sort of disruption stuff to go to happen. If it's not her boot number, then I'm not sure what the uh, the password will be. It's quite an interesting choice of direction here too, where she spends half of her dialogue facing the wrong direction. And it really does highlight Highlight? Highlight how cumbersome those suits are. I mean, good lord, she has to waddle so much. Really, really waddling. I do like what they've done, done in the missile silo here. It's very... I imagine this is probably quite similar to the setup that Sinclair had uh, for his illicit time machine. It's all very... Yeah, she's got all the stuff, but it is not really up to snuff, as it were. While you were unconscious, I looked at your evidence biochip. That's some pretty incriminating stuff. Looks like I've got no choice. I'm going to have to erase it and uh, mind wipe you. <laughs> well, mind wipe you. <laughs> at least you won't remember how painful it was. In fact, when you wake up back in your apartment in the year 2319, you won't. I'm pretty certain you can't skip it. Will happen, I guess. Well, first I, I've got to send back the uh, environ cart that you stole from me. I'm not quite sure what she's doing there, because naturally, what it, whatever is happening there, that can't send back the environ cart, surely. I mean, sh well, sh I suppose if she knows the exact precise temporal coordinates to send it to, then I. I guess. It's for the better, Gage, but uh, surely she'd have to go and do that herself. Because I, I figured when she walks off screen in just a second, that would be your first moment to, to do something, to act, to, you know, solve a puzzle, to get, get free or something. I wasn't expecting there to be quite as much exposition as there was. There's a good chance I'll cut all of this out, of course, but knowing me, I'll probably forget and completely gloss over this and force you to watch it a second time because I am all about giving you the genuine experience of playing the game I said this uh, a lot in the Diablo uh, 2 LP that I, I don't want to give you a, an, an edited, cut down version of the past this is what you would have to do and what I have to do in order to, to solve the game and I, you know, I, I, still, I do have those five minutes later little uh, sideshow attractions that I used a lot in Armacrog. 
But those really were me just sitting there going, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> much, much like with the translation of the uh, Breath of Ipas, whatever its name was. The ones before that. But every single one of my historical research missions involves studying. Oh, God, we have to watch all that. So. I've been to the Nazi death yes, we. Our hearts bleed for you, my dear. We. I've seen the terrorist massacres. Yep, it's I awful, but you can't let it get to you. You can't possibly imagine the horror of seeing a bustling city of thousands vaporized by. Yep. Or a crowd of people shredded into bloody ribbons by a single shrapnel. It's true. And you can make the same argument about the huge massacres on medieval battlefields with just people hacking each other to pieces with uh, swords and pole arms and what have you. Which is probably somewhat more brutal than the instant um, death provided by heavy arms. This place is you talking behind you to no one. I'm not quite sure why. What are you looking at? I'm over here. Over here. Turn around. Come on. I, I know you, you want to show off the suit that they undoubtedly spent a long time making. Uh, the, the, the suit, they clearly spent a long time engineering those suits. Then this is their best chance to show them off. But it's okay. If, if you're gonna have your little evil monologue, at least monologue to my face. And now, time for the third act. I figured out that I was the one that rigged the security grid. I had to be able to get the things I needed from the Pegasus warehouse without being seen. It's true. But when you started asking around about the mistake in the grid, well, I mean the future you, that is, um, I had to change my plans. So, instead of just sending the information to my contact, I came up with the idea of hiding it in a historical artifact. Artifacts from your research it's a good plan. After all, she is right that if we figured out where the plans were taken from, the TSA could just go and get them back again. But at the, at the same time, there are many ways to discreetly and covertly send information. I even found some valuable trinkets to plant in your locker at that time. Just that one simple move would give you a motive, and the court a scapegoat. But, um, Plus, if, if she's using her actual TSA suit, I never thought for a surely the TSA suit will have some sort of record. Do manual scans? Someone must have been bored out of their minds that day. I'm sorry, Gage. I really am. Hmm, that's a good point, actually. The the manual scan. That was probably done intentionally. So, uh, someone had to have tipped off the whoever did, did the scan. I, I forget who. As I say, it was, it was weeks ago. Someone must have tipped them off to get them to do that scan. I imagine it's something that'll come up once we uh, get past this little fracas. I'm sorry Hopefully I'll be able to make a save game in just a second. Because it makes you feel better. Oh wait, I said that already. Yep. 76. Final. Password. Okay, three three five three three nine hyphen Oh shit, what what the hell? Three Okay, numpad doesn't work. Three three five three three nine two two seven now Nope Tahiti Godfall 
Well, I'm uh, stuffed. Three three five three nine two two seven. Think of something, anything, heads, hobbies, power tools, types of cheeses, something personal. Well, that was my only stab in the dark. Uh, Gino Andrews. Blackwood. Love pie. Past the last safety lockout gauge. Uh. Don't get me in there now. Our minds might not be the only things erased. Oh. History could be interesting. Gabba, gabba, hey. Stop. Only one's gauge. Abort. You gotta do it. Uh. Nope. Not a clue. I'm gonna go get something to eat. I'll be back in a few.